So we have been rolling right along on our indie game series. And today we're gonna check out yet another one called Wrong Floor. Essentially what happens is you are in an elevator that crashes into the basement. What you don't know is that actually somebody else is living there and you are now intruding into their home. Now you have to find a way out. Double pie five. Without further ado, guys, let's get into it. All right, so here we go, guys. Here is Wrong Floor, and I will put all the download links below if you want to check this game out. So let's give it a go. It already looks spooky, and the ambiance is already crazy. Let me get my headphones cranked up here so I can get the full experience, and let's get to it. Okay. So we've got some stairs going down. Okay, I'm walking. Can I run? Guys, this is really, really sweet. Let's see what my reflection looks like. Okay. So, okay. So this is supposed to be like a 10, 15 minute game. So let's see. What can I do here? Is this the elevator? Can I push the button? There it is. Can we go up? Better use elevator. Okay. So I think it's coming up. We can hear it. Pretty cool, guys. This is really, really cool. Okay, here it comes. All right, this elevator has definitely seen better days, right? Um, a lot of creaking. I would not personally get on this elevator if I had a choice. Um, so where do we need to go? So one, 10. We going to 10? Okay, we're on eight. So... Oh, I don't know. I guess 10 was probably not the right choice, but is this 10? Okay, one. Okay, so it doesn't matter what you chose. Okay, so this elevator did not. Oh, okay, that scared me. Wow, okay, that was really, really cool, guys. I did not expect that. Um, all right, so let's go. Okay, listen. Drip drop. Okay, great. So the elevator is now gone. Okay, so there is a light. Can we shine it around? Um, 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 um. Okay, what is, is that? Oh, it's into that pan. Okay. Um, okay, so that's a door. So do I need to use, maybe I need to go in this room. Is there anything else I should know? Okay, okay. Here's something over here. Probably don't want to go into here. Okay, I can see something. Um, okay, I hear rats. That is absolutely disgusting. Um, oh, there's a dead body. Okay, guys, this game is really cool. Okay. It looks like it's been there for some time. Now, what happened to it? Okay, so there's definitely some decomposing. Um, I hear flies buzzing and it looks like is that its intestines are spilled out. Oh, there's a bug right there um, Okay, so it's really bright this light is um, do I want to keep going this way? I don't Okay, so I can keep going this way um, So now I opted to not open up the door to that other room Okay, is that a heartbeat um, and instead kind of just like Go this way first. So I don't know if that was the right choice. Um, okay, so there's some shelving. We're going to kind of just keep going this way. Okay, something's eating something. That is ridiculous. Do you hear that? Okay, it sounds like a dog when a dog eats food and it like really chomps it up real quick. Um, wolf sit down, so to say. Okay, it sounds like something is chewing. Like, like intensely chewing. Okay, what the freaking heck was that? That just scared the living bejesus out of me. Okay, so, okay, so where was the chewing coming from? Now, what was chewing? And how come when I grabbed this flashlight, the chewing stopped? Now, that is the question. So, can I open this? I want to open that. Can I open any of this? This looks like it's already open. 
Okay, what in the living heck is that? Do you see that? Guys, what in the heck is that? Why is there something looking back at me in this drawer? This, uh, this cabinet. What is looking back at me? What is this? Open. I want to see. Okay. That is really freaky, guys. It is literally like a floating eyeball. Okay, well, I'm just going to ignore that I saw that. We're going to keep on going. Okay, we're going to totally ignore that. And let's keep on going, guys. Okay. Definitely some blood. Um, I don't remember this being here. Can I do something with this? So this looks fresh. This definitely looks fresh. Um, so we're just going to keep on going. Oh, okay. <laughs> Guys, that really terrified me. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um... I'll be getting the clean undies out after this video. Don't ask questions and don't judge. Okay, can I open this? Okay, now where did... I don't know, guys. I'm at a loss for words. Um, now, where did that thing go that, like, so definitely was in front of me and now it's gone? So, I don't know. Maybe I made the right choice by not going in the door first. So, I'm going to make my way back here. Okay, there's a bag of garbage. Is there anything? Can I check it? Um, a bottle, a lamp. Okay. Drippity, drippity. So I guess we're going to go in here, right? Can we go in here? Okay, so what am I supposed to do? Okay, so that's locked too. So I'm not supposed to go in there. Did I go that? I don't think I went that way. Okay, so let's go down this creepy dark hallway. Okay, guys, if something jumps out at me again, please don't judge, please. Okay, attention, extremely dangerous maniac. Height 2.5 meters, age 30 years, cuts all over the body. Homeless, may hide in abandoned buildings or basements. The police asks for assistance in disseminating information about a particularly dangerous offender. Okay, guys, this is, oh, there he is. Oh my gosh, guys, that is the creepiest thing I've ever seen. I I'm, I'm thoroughly creeped out. Um, I'm not even gonna go that way. Uh, heck no. Um, why would I? Okay, what's this way? You over there? Guys, this game is giving me the absolute chills. Woo! Oh my gosh. Okay, anywho, I'd love to go back that way, but I just saw somebody creep out around the corner, so. Okay, what's in here? Okay, another one of these things. We've got some old mattresses, and we also have. What is this? Okay, are there any more eyeballs in there? Um, can I get this way? What is that? There's bugs, that's for sure. Okay, there's a cola. Okay, what's in here? Is it gonna jump out at me? Okay, any eyeballs in there? No, just empty. What does it say? L. Oh, what is L? Oh, L is crazy, guys. Oh, man, look at L. Who's behind me? Are you kidding me? Guys, there was somebody behind me. I'm not kidding you. They, I, I'm serious. There was someone behind me. Okay. Okay, guys. I am super creeped out. I am really creeped out. Okay, is this guy... Gonna come back and jump out of nowhere because... I hope he does not, but he's going to. I know that for sure. Okay, so this door is now busted down. Um, that's good to know. So let's go ahead and give a look-see into here. Okay, we are now in full-out L mode. And I'm pretty sure someone is going to be behind me. Yep, for sure. Uh, what is this? Okay, some sort of... I don't know. I don't know what that is. So we're going to keep walking this way, guys. I'm in full-out creep mode. 
Um, both in my way that I'm walking and in the way I feel. Okay. Oh, jeez. What in the living heck is this? Okay, so should I approach him? Okay, he's got marks all over his body, guys. Look at this. That's it for me, guys. That's it for me. It has been an absolute blast. Um, hey, bro. Oh! Should I have not done that? Okay, guys. So I wanted to get a redo of this area. Okay, there he goes walking. Okay, before I kind of like, I don't know, antagonized him by like walking up onto him and... Yeah, he, uh, he decked my lights out. So, we are not gonna do that this time. And I am just gonna kind of walk past him. Okay, so there he is in there. So, I am gonna just keep on going, guys. Because, uh, that last way was not good. Okay, this says, the code behind the red cabinet. Oh, man. Okay, the code behind the red cabinet. Okay, so, um, I don't know what that code is. And there's a bunch of red cabinets, so I am going to avoid him. Okay, he is now gone. Okay, so perhaps the game knew I was going to have to come back this way and look for a red cabinet. Um, yeah, going up to him and, uh, basically messing with him was not the right move because he knocked me out. So let's try and find the code behind the red cabinet, guys. Um, ooh, there's a creepy picture. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, that just scared me. Ooh, Nelly. Okay, the picture's gone. Okay, guys, I am straight up. I'm straight up chilly willy over here. Okay, let's see. Code behind the red cabinet. Can I open it? Okay, L. I see the L thing. Yeah, he's right behind me. Yep, we know he's right behind me. Um, yep, he's he's right there. Uh, super creepy. Um, can I open this red cabinet or or what? Okay, the code behind the red cabinet. Now, where is the where? What do you mean behind? Code behind the red cabinet. We don't know where that is. Okay, can't be broken with a crowbar. Okay, so where is this red cabinet? That's not a red cabinet. Um, This way, perhaps? Okay, there was definitely a red cabinet this way. So let's head back to see if we can't find a red cabinet code. Um, here's a red cabinet. Okay, there's eyeballs in there. We know there's eyeballs. Okay, here's a red cabinet. Okay, is that it? There it is. Um... What is that? Is that 661? Oh, I got to pull it out. Okay, 1990. Guys, that was sweet. Okay. 1990. Okay, I can zoom in with the right mouse button. I just figured that out. Um, okay, that's definitely sweet. We're going to have to do that. So let's get into this mode. Okay, there's the man looking behind us. Okay, 1990. Um, actually, I don't like that. Okay, so let's get back to the to the com and let's put this com in. Okay, something's gonna jump out and scare me any second now. Um, if I look like a little coward, cowardly person, um, well, that's just what it is. Okay, so here we go. Okay, this is where we need to go. We're going to head back to the comm and put it in. Okay, hopefully he's not back over there. Okay, jeez Louise. Are you kidding me? Um, is he in there? No. Okay, so... Okay, 
So walking up to him that one time. What is that noise? Okay. What the heck is going on? Okay, I don't know what is happening. Okay. I am freaked out, though. Okay, here we go. No. Okay. There we go. One. Nine. Nine. Zero. Um, I'm sure this is going to be good, guys. Okay, there is a wrench. Oh my gosh. Okay, so perhaps if I can get a crowbar, I can get a crowbar. Um, tools. Okay, so this was the tool room. I should have known that. Okay, so I now wield a tool or a crowbar, I should say. Oh man, so this is where he does his his dirty work, so to say. Um, this is where he keeps all his uh his tools of torture. So here we go, guys. Um. I'm going to try and bust open this wooden area with... What is that? Uh, that's a torture room, guys. What the heck? Okay, I'm not going in there. Um, no way, no how am I going into that room. Um, I feel like it wanted me to go in there. Okay, there we go. Okay, uh, yeah... Should I hit this? Okay, what is this? Okay, maybe I can flip the breakers to the elevator. I think that might be what I need to do. Okay, because that torture room, guys, I do not want to go into that torture room. No way in heck am I going in the torture room. Unless he captures me and puts me in the torture room. Okay, so my flashlight, it has gotten like smoky-ish or like foggy down here. So let's see, does the elevator work now? Can I give it a go? Okay, what is happening? Did that do it? Oh, he's right behind me. Oh, look at him. He looks so scary. Oh, he's crazy. Okay, what a horrifying menace he is. Okay, so am I supposed to run away or what? Um, I'm just gonna go in the elevator. Is he gonna come in with me? Uh, any button. Any button. Guys, and I mean, what in the heck? That was so scary, guys. Oh my gosh. That was absolutely terrifying. I, I mean, honestly, I mean, I had chills, um, just like all over my body, and I really got jump scared pretty bad a couple times, guys. Make sure, leave a like and a comment below if you want to see more indie games or if you want to see more horror games, if you like that genre, guys. Also, if you don't mind, hit that subscribe button for us, guys. And until we see you in the next video, guys, this one, this was a good one. Guys, take care. Bye-bye.